So you've tried mewing, you maybe seen my video on mewing, and you can't breathe. This is by far the most frequent comment on that video is that I can't breathe while I'm mewing the way you said to. And so to mew correctly, again, you put your tongue on the roof of your mouth, the entire tongue on the entire roof of your mouth. And the metaphor I used was, imagine you take a spoon and you dip that spoon into a tub of peanut butter, flip the spoon upside down, the peanut butter is your tongue and the spoon's the roof of your mouth. So stuck up there the entire way. But if you do that, your tongue may protrude out into the nasal pathway where you breathe in air into your lungs through your nose. So this is what most people I assume are doing. So that was me trying to breathe. I'm gonna do the mewing thing, the, the bad mewing, and then try to breathe. I can't, I can't breathe through my nose at all. I can't breathe through my mouth at all because my tongue's blocking it. So now I'm going to do correct mewing. And I can breathe all the way in through my belly, all the way through my nose is perfectly clear. So to fix this, the reason why you can't breathe through your nose when you're mewing is because it's blocking your nasal airway. You keep your tongue on the entire roof of your mouth, but you don't let it block your airway back there. So that's it. Keep practicing. My girlfriend's here. I'll see you in the next video. Have a great day.